just come across this species of ammonite, Asterosterus stellari. Unfortunately, it only looks half to be there, so it might not have a middle, but it's a lovely chamber. You've got a lovely coloured calcite there. Unfortunately, it's not complete. This nodule here, I'm going to be digging out in a second. Part of a negative there, part of an ammonite chamber there, and just above here, another nodule here, and the remains of calcite ammonite from an initial species just at the top here. Whether there'll be anything else inside, I have to have a look. So, just crack those nodules, um, so obviously that asterisk. It might have a little bit of the middle there. Beach. It's a lovely ammonite, but regardless, really. So that's a negative there. So I found. And in the other nodule, there's a little Arniosteri, so I just clean that up when I get back. So the weather's changed a bit, a bit better, really, now. It's starting to rain. I think it's possible. a lot easier, actually. It helps you highlight, it helps highlight all the right rocks, let's just say that. But there's a small little nodule here. I've just cracked the edge of it, just inside every species of ammonite, just there, right in the middle. I'll take that back as it is now. Just spotted at the corner of my eye. So, Peter Crinoid. Uh, yes, it is quite worn, but. Still, this side's a little 